So today we are going to do the DVD menu walkthrough of the Neighborhood Animals 2002 DVD. Now, obviously, I have the early 2002 DVD, and if even if I did get the late 2002 DVD, it's technically still the same thing. So, I mean, why would I want a duplicate? So, yeah, as underrated as the cover is, we're still gonna look at the DVD menu. Despite that the DVD menu is the same. Still gonna do that. I was originally going to have my cat be the guest of this, but but he but my camera ran out of ran out of storage on my first take. And my And Gilly wanted to go eat. Play a movie. Obviously, I'm not going to play it, but it's the common Disney one. Play music. Obviously, I'm not going to play it. I'm really. I don't really know if the concert halls are really copyright worthy. But I know. Oh, that um. Pirate and Rift haven't gotten any strikes, but I don't want to risk that. Same with the flashcards. I don't want to risk any copyright strikes. I already got one. And one is all I need. the puppet shows obviously I'm not going to play them because of copyright issues resources obviously I'm not going to play the video tutorial but other products love all these awards I might like make a fan made other products oh yeah the Shakespeare has the uh, got Shakespeare FHG Gecko tape was probably released when they were in the FHG the version of and it came out. They also made a, like a prototype language nursery 2002 slash FHE um, VHS thing. Oh yeah, my one Mozart, Santa Van Gogh, three of my favorites. They were animals with the cat. They could have had the bluebird cover too, but whatever. All the CDs are normal except for classical animals. Now, that classical animal CD looks very weird. Yeah, I mean, and cool too. I wish it, wish that cover existed in real life. But you know, it has the red dogs and red violet music notes. Cool. Webster, I think, was supposed to be be a video. And here are the books. I really want some of the play school stuff because it would be fun. And then, Neighborhood Animals Toy Chest. The puppets are really cool. I really, I really wish I had the pre-Disney horse. At least I have a pre-Disney cow and pre-Disney Pavlov. And the pre-Disney duck. Which aren't in the greatest condition, but not horrible. And now, we're going to go to the coloring book. Alright, so what I've done is taken the DVD out of the player because we're going to explore the coloring book. And I'll zoom this up. Yeah. Okay, okay. Let me. Hold on, I'm gonna exit it out of Windows Media Player. And then. Okay, neighborhood coloring. Despite the cover being the exact same, like red Pavlov and the blue eyed frog, it's still really cool to look at. I mean, because it's not common for. a DVD to have a coloring book. I mean, Numbers Nursery should have had one. Where's Numbers Nursery coloring book? Oh yeah, that's right. Oh, 
Where did Interactual Media Player? Here we go. It, yeah, the cover is the exact same with red Pavlov and the blue eyed frog. Pavlov, Misty, Cohen, the bluebird, Einstein, the caterpillar, or VTG, Ladybug, Bok, the rabbit. B. McDonald, the cow, BBB Go, or or Vincent, the pig, the sheep, Kyrat, or the duck, and the frog. Now I'm going to show you the printout version once again. Although I only printed it for my Apache DVD, I would still, I would, I'm still going to show it in three, two, one. Look what I found. Oh, and by the way, the DVD cover, it's yes, yes, the DVD cover of Neighborhood Animals 2002 is Chase Ace 5127, which I love Chase Ace 5127. I hope he comes back. But anyways, we are going to review this, the Baby Doolittle Neighborhood Animals coloring book, starring Pavlov, Stella, and the Frog. So yeah, Red Pavlov and the Frog with the Blue Eyes, at least the Frog has the Blue Eyes, even though it doesn't have that little darker green thing. It's the cat's there. It's kind of an underrated cover. I don't think I think this add two more is more underrated. There's Pavlov, Misty, Cohen the Bluebird, Einstein the Caterpillar, Ladybug from Numbers Nursery, Dylan and DJ, or Baby Bach, um, B McDonald. Baby B Go, the pig, um, Max Lamb and Bobber Lamb, the duck, and or Kyrat and the frog. So yeah, guys, yeah, that's it for my. The next time I'll show this is in my neighborhood animals collection on Saturday, May fifteenth. So come to the premiere, or if. It's the least you guys could do. Anyways, be sure to leave a like, comment, subscribe, and see ya.